Okay, here with Ralph Freiburg's Bowling Green Falcons. Ralph, just going into tonight's game, you're the leader in assists for the team. What is there any kind of pressure added on to you? How do you work on the defensive line like that? I don't know. There's no pressure for us. We're like a team and we're supporting each other with like the plays and everything else. So there was no pressure with points at all. And how I deal with it, I don't know, just try and play my best, you know. Probably try to pass it more than shoot it, which which could be sometimes bad, you know. But everything's okay, just trying to, trying to do my best every game, you know. Big win last night. Is it one of those things where you have to prepare more so to where you don't overlook a team like UAH coming in? No, it was like we lost a game in, uh, in, uh, at home against them. That was the only lost loss at home this season. So it was like we were we were, we were preparing for like big game. You know, we were, we wanted to prove them that that was a mistake when they when we lost the game there. So we were we were preparing hard this week. Like after a break, it was pretty tough. We okay, like one of the toughest two breaks we ever had. So we were well prepared, and we know we knew like they're going to be a tough team to play against, and we were well prepared. For it. Playing the WCHA, there's a lot of difficult teams, some teams nationally ranked. What is it like to play in the WCHA this season? WCHA is like it's more like a tough. Te- there's a lot of tough teams to play against. You know, when we played against like teams like BC, we played all over break in Pittsburgh. It was like more skilled team, which sometimes is easier to play because you can read the game. But in WCHA, guys are like working hard every game, so it's like it's. You need to be ready to take a hit to make a play every game, and uh, it's sometimes, especially for me, it's kind of difficult, you know. Now, with some of the travel in WCHA, have there been any really favorite rinks you played in other than yours? Uh, obviously, our, our our rink is the best. We got the best fans in the league and uh, probably in the nation. So, but other than that, who, who do I like playing in? Uh, can the over break when we played in a tournament in Pittsburgh? That was awesome. But like in our league. There's nothing like I like the Alabama here. Okay. It's a, I, I like the crowd is not big, but like it's nice playing against them. It's like big ring, big ice sheet. What else I liked? Have you been to Alaska yet? No, not this oh, year. You looking? Oh, okay. Yeah. So maybe looking forward to that maybe. Okay. Now going on just with your your career playing for your country. What's it like to play on your country's national team? It's, it's a great honor to play for a national team and uh, it's something like every kid back home looks off for too. And that's like that was my goal to like when I was a kid to play for the national team and the same thing that's playing and uh, for the players you well ten years ago you were looking on TV like adore them how they played and and, uh, and one year you just made uh, playing with them on the same lineup uh, it's it's something unbelievable and playing for your country is like indescribable and the same thing playing against teams like USA playing all against those all NHL players is it's something you're never gonna forget you know now, what's what is it that brought you to North America? Is it just the kind of studies that you wanted to portray, or is it hockey that brought you here? Number that, one. Number one, I was like when I was a kid, I wanted to like try it out to playing hockey in the USA, and uh, the opportunity showed up, and uh, I came here, and right away I knew about like I didn't go to Canada because I knew like for life it's pretty tough to play to two major juniors, so I, I came here t- uh, with a goal to play college hockey. So that worked out right now, and I'm here, and I'm. F- Loving each moment I'm here, and uh, it's it's wonderful. And a little bit more about you. Who were some of your favorite hockey players when you were growing up? When I was growing up, uh, like one Latvian son, so was Lynch, who played for Colorado Avalanche, uh, won the Stanley Cup '96. It was like guy I looked up for the most. But like now, uh, now there, I don't know really like guys who I'm like, looking out for. Like I like how Brad Richards play. Mm-hmm. So like maybe he's a forward, but like I like his. Yeah, how he plays, like Chris Letang, maybe that guy I can look out for. But like uh, every every team of the players who are looking out for, and trying to learn something like from each player, you know, how, how all those little things of what they do best. So, just that's it. Okay, well, thank.